introduce the next portion of today's show. He's a freshman at West Laco High School. He's on the freshman football team and drama club. He's hoping to join the student council this year, and after college, he hopes to become a comic book artist. He's the son of Marisa Garcia. Let's put our hands together for the game show host of Tech Trivia, Rico Martinez. Martinez, I just passed on to the ninth grade at Westlico High School. Sorry. <laughs> and I'm today's host for a new segment to this year's convocation called Tech Trivia. Now, the beach balls have already been released. Do you guys have fun with that? I liked it. It was cool. Yeah. Alrighty. Now, here are the rules. We're gonna form three teams of two individuals, as we've already done. That's, my math skills tell me we have five. <laughs> um, <laughs> woo, yeah. Now, they're already up on stage. Um, you'll be asked either a tech trivia question or you'll be asked to solve or interpret one of the thousands of today's texting acronyms. So. It's okay, it's okay, hold on, hold on. <laughs> All right. No, don't be worried, it's okay. Now, here's an example of how it will work. I will read the letters of an acronym, and the first person to hit their buzzer will have the chance to tell the audience what the acronym stands for. For example, I will read what the letters LOL mean. Man, that is, woo, okay. And then, it's and a of light course, switch. the answer is, Laugh out loud. Now, today's acronyms are really just yesterday's shorthand. And so we haven't gone that far away from the note-taking skills that many of you used in high school and college. Now, we've already made the team selections from our studio audience, and... Woo! All right. <laughs> yeah, I like that. All right. Now, but first, let me introduce my game show co-host, Mr. Trevino. Thank you, Rico. Woo! Congratulations, you are the first set of contestants for this first round of Tech Trivia. Woo! The team with the highest points at the end of the round will win, listen to this, a Western palm leaf straw hat by Adwood, provided to us by Marty Masso of Boots and Jeans of Westlaco, a $60 value, or an in-studio family photo session worth $150, from Nava Studios, also here from Westaco. Back to you, Rico. Thank you, Mr. Trevino. Woo, yeah. Now, let's take a moment to meet our contestants. Tell us your names and which campuses or departments you represent. Starting off on Team Blue. I work at West... It's on, right? Yeah, it's on. Yeah, <laughs> I work at Westaco East. My name is Tomas Padilla. <laughs> Sabrina Cuellar, Cuellar Middle School. Elvira Ledesma Aguayo, Westaco East High School. Paula Martinez, Mary Lord, number one. Oh, 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 oh. Joe Ramos, Westaco East. Go east side. Chrisette Mojica, home of the Rico Rockets. All righty. Let's give our contestants a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, contestants, we'll divide the segment into five questions. Three will be acronyms and two will be tech trivia questions. Now, if you get the answer right, give yourselves 10 points from the flip down binders on your podiums. Now, if you don't get it right, the next team to buzz in will have their chance and so on and so forth. All righty. Do you guys want to hear the first acronym? Yes. Do you guys want to hear the first acronym? Yes. I can't hear you. Yes. Still nothing, that, that was lame. Okay, we'll try next time. Okay, the first acronym is I-L-M-J. 
Team Blue. I love my jeans. That is incorrect. Five seconds. Team Green. I love Mary Ho Jaguars. <laughs> Team Red. I love my job. That is correct. Ten points to Team Red. I love my job. Woo. Now, the correct answer was, I love my job. And I'm sure all of you do, just as much as I love school. Yeah. I love my job, too. The next is a trivia question, and I'm looking for the technical meaning to the term. Now, who can tell me what the term huge pipes means? Rico, <laughs> did you say huge pipes? I said huge pipes, and I'm not sure why some of you are laughing. I'm only 14. OK. <laughs> Five seconds. Team Blue? A loud voice. A loud voice? No, ma'am. This is tech trivia. <laughs> Team Red? No it, more help. That means a big, like, internet line? That is correct. Ten Ooh. points to Team Red. Now, that's slang for having a high bandwidth internet connection. The larger the pipes, the more bandwidth of information to come and go freely from your computers to the World Wide Web. Yeah, you guys are... <laughs> Alrighty, the next question is again an acronym. Who can tell me what the letters CMB mean? CMB. Now, the contestants can't get help from our studio audience, Team Red. Call me back. That is correct. Team Red with the blow of 30 points to Team Red. I'll give you guys a chance to catch up. Now, be ready. Give me a number. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> IDK. Okay. Okay, okay, turn off the buzzer. I don't know my number anymore. That's my wife. Awkward, okay. Uh, <laughs> whoa. All righty. Now, I'll try to get Team Green and Team Blue to catch up. For a 10-point bonus, get ready. For a 10-point bonus, who can tell me what the letters G1 mean? The contestants can't get help from our studio audience. Team Blue. Good one? That is correct. Team Blue has good one for 10 points. That's 20. You're a cheater. I mean, what's up with that? There you go. Uh, okay. Good one, Rico. Woo. Good one. All right. Mr. Trevino, after three questions. After three questions, Team Red leads with 30 points, followed by Team Blue with 10 points. And I don't think the green light is working. Yeah. Is it good? Are you good? Hold on. Don't we get When you turn this on and you get it right, then yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> All righty, our fourth question is from our list of tech trivia questions. Who can tell me the meaning of the word ransomware? Did you say ransomware? I said ransomware. Now remember, this is a technical meaning. Now, do we have anyone? Uh, Team Green. Isn't, isn't that something that takes over your computer when you don't want it to? They come in. Yeah. That is correct. Yes. Team Green has 10 points. Yeah. Now, the definition is on the wall. It's an attempt to extort money by holding its data to a ransom. That is correct. Now, in recent news, our technology department recently discovered a ransomware this past school year. Can we have a round of applause for our technology department? <laughs> Woo, yeah, right there. What's up? OK. All righty. We have one more question to, one more question to the end of the round and an opportunity for Team Red to have a commanding lead or for Team Green to fall further behind. <laughs> now. <laughs> the last acronym. Rico, before we go forward, I believe that's supposed to be 10 points. 
We didn't go to school, son. Right there. <laughs> They're cheating. Ah, otra vez. No, they had ten Penalty. points. They had just one time. No fue penal. Yes. <laughs> Alrighty. The last acronym for the round is BTW. By Team the Red. Way. By Team the Red. way. I saw that. What was it? By the way. That is correct. Ten points to Team Red. All righty. Any tiebreakers? No tiebreakers. All righty, that's fine. Okay. All righty, that's the end of the first round. Team Red is our clear winner. Now, we'd like to thank you all for participating. Now, Teams Green and Blue, we have nothing for you. Okay. Um, We'd like to thank our sponsors for this first round's prizes. Let's give Marty Masso from Boots and Jeans and Joel Nava from J Nava Studio a round of applause for this generous contribution. Now we'll be back for round two of Set Trivia in just a few minutes. I'm Rico Martinez. Where's the music at? All righty, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Rico Martinez, and it's time for round two of Tech Trivia. We still need one more player, Rico. Where? He has the beach ball. <laughs> All right, there we go, number six. Now this is Team Red, Team Green, and Team Blue. Now. The, mu the balls have been dropped, and, well, you guys want to try, uh, I guess. All right. Now, go ahead and select the team partner, which you guys have already done. Now, once again, we'll do three acronyms and two tech trivia questions. Now, the first acronym is, oh, hold on. You guys are cheaters. Who's up? 40 points, yeah. There we go. All right. Now, the first acronym is, it's a very, very long one. <laughs> um, a N A W F O S. It's okay. Do you guys do you guys know this one? <laughs> and speaking of our sponsors. And speaking of our sponsors, the winning team for this round can either win a date night huh? that includes movie tickets, gift cards to dinner for two and a few other goodies from our friends at Imagine Learning and Cinemark Theaters, a $75 value, and a $250 gift basket from Cardenas BMW from Harlingen. I hear that if even you don't own a Beamer, the gift basket will make you feel like you do. That's nice, all righty. Yeah. Beamer, okay. Now, our next segment of tech trivia is, in fact, a tech question. Who can tell me what a phablet is? It's not phablet. It's phablet. OK. Now, you can get help from our studio audience. You guys, you guys can help them. Team Blue. Who it was green. Green was green? first. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Green. <laughs> it's like a phone tablet. Yeah, that's, that's correct, yeah. Okay. Team Green has 10 points. Now, it's bridging the gap between a large smartphone and a small tablet device. Now, the next acronym is L-I-G. This is my favorite song, Team Blue. Life is good. That is incorrect. Team Red. <laughs> Life is great. That is incorrect. Team Green, please. Let it go? That is correct. Let it go. 10 points to Team Green. All righty. Mr. Trevino? After three questions, Team Green has 20 points. Team Blue and Team Red have nothing. It's OK. All right. Make it rain? OK. Now, the next is a trivia question. What does it mean to serve up the cookie? 
Did you say serve up the cookie? I said serve up the cookie. Yes, they're not chocolate chip. I've checked. Okay. <laughs> um, you guys have five seconds. Team Red? Something to do with tracking your internet? Excuse me? Your internet website tracking or something like that? We'll okay. take it. All right. Do you say we'll that? take Team it. Team Red. Well, hold on, hold on. Do you guys have anything? I don't know you say that. Okay. Team Red has 10 points. Um, I get, yeah. All righty. Now, our last acronym and a chance for Team Green to have a commanding lead or for Team Red to catch up and for Team Blue to actually get a point. <laughs> now, who can tell me the meaning? Oh, wait, hold on. Um, you guys should get your buzzers ready because, I mean, I know you guys aren't familiar with a lot of these, but I'm pretty sure you know this one. I mean, you guys are teachers. You guys have heard this one. YOLO. Team Blue. You only live once. Huh? That is correct. Team Blue has the 10 points. Woo, see, look, we got some. All righty. Now, we have a bonus round, just to make things interesting. I'm going to put it up to 20 points. Now, who can tell me the meaning of the acronym? R-O-T-F-L. Team, team Rolling Blue. on the floor laughing. That is correct, and woo, yeah. Woo! A fast round, you guys. Are... Let me have your nothing. Okay, that's the end of round two of Tech Trivia. Team Blue has won the round, Woo! and falling closely behind is Team Green with 20 points. Once again, the winning teams on the round take home prizes from a date night. Guys, don't go together, okay? For two, and... yes, let's clarify. <laughs> including movie tickets, dinner for two, and a few other goodies from Imagine Learning and Cinema Theaters. And also for the Beamer, Beamer Wannabe and You, a $250 gift basket full of BMW goodies. Thank you, Mr. Trevino. Now back to our regularly scheduled programming. Back to you, beautiful weather girl. Thank you, Rico. Call me. Now, this is the final round of Tech Trivia, and of course, I'm your wonderful host, Rico Martinez. Yeah, okay. Now, so far, we've had a great time with all our contestants, and I just want to take a minute to show how different our generation is when it comes to technology. Now, I don't, how many of you are 25 years or older? Raise your hands. We won't judge, we won't judge, stop laughing. <laughs> All right, no, that's fine, okay, hey, hey. All righty, now, how many of you wear wristwatches? Watches, raise your hands. <laughs> More hands, okay. All righty, now that's interesting, because if you asked a group of my friends, or teenagers in general, they'd probably say, what for when I have my smartphone? True. Um, your wristwatch is what we call a single function device. Uh, Rico, I want to clarify, my watch actually tells the date. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Mr. Trevino. His watch says the date. Thank you. For your double function device. Thank you. But seriously, us kids are growing up with smartphones and gadgets that not only tell time, but can fulfill literally hundreds of multi-level functions, from entertainment to research to our social networks and beyond. And wristwatches have had to conform to keep up with smartphones and multifunctional devices. Now, let me ask this question. How many of you wear wristwatches that can keep the time, tell the date, can keep your heart rate, count the steps you take every day, and keep your blood temperature? One, that's it. All righty. No? Okay, it was a question. All right, now that's a great example of how we students need each of you teachers to conform to the way we students learn today. Yeah, anyway, I'm not a keynote speaker, so let's just get on with the show. All right. Now, it's time for Tech Trivia, and we have our group of contestants. Can we please flip the points over? All right. Now, the music has stopped. We have our six contestants, and the prize is Mr. Trevino. All right, now, the winners of this round will be awarded, listen to this, an iPad 
from the firm of Robert J. Garza, that's Gallagher Benefit Service Woo! and Wells, Well Works here in Westaco, and a six-month membership to the Ultimate Fitness Center from our friend and owner, Jason Martinez. Woo, round of applause. Woo. Back to you, Rico. Thank you. Now, contestants, tell us which campus or departments you represent. Uh, Jeremy Miller, uh, Dr. Armando Cuer Middle School. Woo! Goya? All right. Samantha Mize, Science Department, Dr. Armando Cuer Middle School. Again, Goya! Woo! Juan Mujica, District Library of Services. Woo, library, what's up? Lucia Mintz, the Theater Department at Wisco East. Dee Dee Oliveira, the Migrant Department. Eva Nava, Airport Elementary. Woo! Yeah. Those are the rowdiest ones, right? Those are the rowdiest ones? Okay. Who's ready for the first acronym? Are you guys ready for the first acronym? Yep. Are you guys ready for the first acronym? Sure. For real? I can't even hear you. All righty. Who can tell me the meaning of JS? Team Red. Just saying. That is correct. 10 points to Team Red for Just Saying. Now, don't forget that our studio audience can also contribute. So the first team to answer, even if they hear from the audience, still gets the points. It's not cheating. Okay? Now, Team Red has the first 10 points. Now, the next portion is, in fact, a tech trivia question. Who can tell me the meaning of yo-yo mode? Did you say yo-yo mode? I said yo-yo mode, and this one really does have a double meaning, ladies and gentlemen. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. And okay, blank answers, it's all right. Now, if you can look up at the screen, yo-yo mode is when a computer rapidly alternates several times between being up and being down. Yeah. Now, it's also slang for when guys or girls string you along. <laughs> yeah. As in, dude, haven't you learned your lesson about her yet? She's in permanent yo-yo mode. <laughs> now, are you ready for our second acronym, ladies and gentlemen? Woo. You guys are boring. All righty. <laughs> Who can answer correctly the meaning of P-O-T-A-T-O. -T -T hey, Rico, that's spelled potato. That is spelling potato, but it is not the French fries. I've checked, I've checked, I've checked. <laughs> Five seconds. Studio audience, is there anyone from the technical department here? No? Person <laughs> Hey, I didn't write this. No one? Nothing yet? For real? Oh, Team Red. I got it. Per uh, person over 30 acting 21. Really? Did you come up with that one? Oh, woo! 10 points to Team Red. Person over 30 acting 21. Wow. Alrighty. Mr. Trevino, after three so questions. So after three questions, uh, Team Red is leading with 20 points, <laughs> and the rest of them are out having tea somewhere. I don't know. Now, we're at the last tech trivia question for the day. And the chance to win the iPad, or a chance to, once again, fit into your skinny jeans, win the <laughs> six-month free membership to the Ultimate Fitness Center. <laughs> now, here's the final trivia question. What is the function of an Uber app? An Uber app. To purchase Team Blue, have to buzz in. Team Blue. There you go. To uh, purchase a taxi in a large city? That is correct. 10 points to Team Blue. It is to hail a taxi. Now, we don't have these down here yet, but the app connects passengers to drivers for hire. Good job, awesome. Team Blue. Now, that was our last tech trivia question. Now, this is our last acronym in our final round of tech trivia. <laughs> Who can tell me the meaning of the letters TNT. TNT. It's not the song. Team Red. Till next time. That is correct. Till next time. Stop showing. Any tiebreakers? No? Okay, moving on. Now, this was an amazing. 
Mm -hmm. This is an amazing third and final round. Thank you for your participation. Mr. Trevino? So the winners of this round are Team Red. Once again, our winners get to go home with either an iPad donated by the insurance for, uh, firm of Robert J. Garza, that's Gallagher and Wellworks Benefit Services, or a six-month basic membership to the Ultimate Fitness Center donated by the owner, Jason Martinez. Let's give all of our sponsors a round of applause. Now, contestants, thank you very much again. You all made this convocation for me very fun, exciting, and special. Man, you guys get rowdy, right? Ooh, what's up? All right. Now, and I was honored to be your host. Now, once again, this was Tech Trivia, and I'm Rico Martinez. Let's have a great year. Woo!